hello queens and welcome back today we are going to be doing another one product tutorial and first we're going to start off of course by using some jamaican black castor oil to massage and moisturize our scalp before we go in to actually set and style our hair and then you know i'm going to follow that by simply massaging my scalp massaging your scalp as you guys may know helps promote hair growth it stimulates blood flow and it also helps you to produce your own natural oil called sebum from the scalp to help also make sure that your scalp stays hydrated and doesn't have any dryness or any kind of flakiness going on and then we're simply going to section away each um, section of my hair and as you guys can see my hair is stretched from a previous style that I wore the day before Hey guys, so I just wanted to come on here really quickly and explain to you about the product that I'm using today. The product used to, being used today for my one product tutorial series is the ORS Curls Unleashed Shea Butter and Honey Curl Defining Cream. And this is what it looks like. And I've never used this before. I actually won this from a giveaway that I shared with you guys on my Insta stories over on Instagram. So if you're not following me there, um, you definitely want to follow me on Instagram because right now I'm very much so present on Instagram versus Snapchat. So what we're getting ready to do is simply just mist our hair with some water. I'm going to add some more in here in a little bit. And then after that, I'm just going to simply follow this using the ORS Curls Unleashed Shea Butter and Honey Curl Defining Cream. So we're going to see how this actually works, you guys, because... Um, you guys know I love curl defining creams and I typically stick with my holy grail, you know, Eden Body Works, Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie, and the Botanical Bliss um, Lemon Meringue Curl Defining Custard. Those have been my three go-to curl defining creams um, going into 2017. So, yeah, so without further ado, you guys, I'm fixing to go ahead and start using the curl defining cream again this is from ors curls unleashed and this is the shea butter and honey curl defining cream for naturals all right you guys so as always <laughs> we are going to start off by misting our hair lightly with some water you guys know i always do this step just to ensure that i actually am able to let the product actually absorb into my hair so you always want to mist your hair with water and also to this will help to reactivate any product that you already have on your hair all right so next we're going to detangle you guys know i've been loving my detangling brush from texture pro i'll leave the link to all of the products used in this video of course down below in the description bar all right so we're just going to work on this section that's out and as you guys can see my hair is pretty much past collarbone length so that's pretty good so we're going to start using the ORS Akai Berry Curl Defining Cream. And as you guys can see, it is a very thick cream. I love a very, very heavy curl defining cream. And I'm just smelling it. And I liked how it smells, but you can tell it has something else in there to help preserve the actual curl defining cream. But anyways, we're going to work this into the hair. You just want to make sure that you work it in. It may look a little white at first, but after you work the actual product in itself, then it will disappear. And then of course, I'm just going to go in with my two strand twist. So this is what it looks like. As you can see, my hair is very shiny and very defined. So the goal today for my hairstyle, you guys, is to go for a very big but loose look. I'm not really going for a super defined look. I do feel that if I did this style on washed hair versus, um, you know, about three, four day old wash and go hair, that yeah, the um, definition would definitely have been a lot better. But again, that's not what I was going for. I was just going for a big, nice afro look. And then we're just going to continue this process on to the front part of the head, as you guys can see. And my hair is doing very well, you guys. It's still very much so growing, and I'm still finishing my hair affinity pills. Um, I'm almost fixing to begin month three. As I stated in my update, I have missed a few days, so I'm actually kind of behind on taking the pills. But for the most part, they are making my hair grow. 
and then we're gonna go in again with the two strand twist and you guys this is just a very simple style for when you just really need to refresh your hair for the next day or if you're just going out for the day and um, also too if you're like going to wash your hair the next day but you have to go somewhere the day before two strand twists are a very quick and simple go-to um, refresher <laughs> So this is what my hair looks like after using that one product. Ugh, my hair is really, really shiny as you guys can see. And yeah, I'm not going for like a banging twist I look today. I just kind of want like a big, loose wave kind of look. I'm just going to let this set and we're going to let this dry. And then once we get ready to go out and start the day, I will come back. So that way you guys can see what my hair looks like after letting the product actually set and dry on my hair. So if you're interested in seeing how my hair looks, you guys, then stay tuned. So you guys know I'm going to start off with some of my Marula Nature Marula Oil. I love this stuff and I always use this to take down my hair. And then I'm simply just going to start taking down my hair. And as you guys can see, I got the very loose, um, defined look that I was going for. And I'm just simply going to uh, separate where it wants to. I'm not really caring about any kind of frizz or anything like that because I want a very very big and fluffy look so and we we're going to the beach that day too so I really didn't care and um, I also had to take a headband out there because the wind made it extra big and so I had to pull it up into a puff but for the most part if I hadn't gone out to the beach my style would have pre preserved for the whole day and then the next day I just still went ahead and washed my hair so as you guys can see, my hair is very shiny, it's very soft to the touch, and I really do like that curl defining cream, and it really didn't create any kind of product buildup, nor did it create none of those um, residue balls that would um, typically show up if a product wasn't receptive with another product that you were using, but today we only use water and then the curl defining cream. So this is the finished look. This is exactly what I was aiming for. So I'm so happy that I got the desired look, you guys, for once. I'm just joking. Okay, so again, I use the ORS Curls Unleashed Shea Butter and Honey Curl Defining Cream. And it's a moisturizing curl definition um, cream for naturals. And it says less shrinkage. As you guys can see, my hair really didn't revert much as you guys saw while I was fluffing I just pretty much just took it down some places weren't as defined but again I did do this on stretched hair so um yeah so I really did like using this um you guys I'm wondering I'm looking to make sure that I'm focused but yeah but I really did enjoy using this per se I would actually purchase this because you guys I really don't have a lot of curl defining creams I only use again a majority of probably like three or four at the most and yeah and this one I really did like it has a thick consistency it provides a lot of slip as you guys saw earlier while I was applying this on my hair um, I did make sure to spritz my hair again lightly with water so that way the product could actually you know absorb into the hair so I don't have any like product buildup or any kind of residue left on my hair so I'm grateful <laughs> I'm grateful for that and yeah you guys and the scent I would say um the scent really isn't all the best you can smell the honey and the shea butter but um I don't know it has another scent in there and I'm familiar with it in other products that I've used before but um yeah the scent really doesn't make or break whether or not whether or not I like the product it just really depends on if it's going to give me that look that definition that I'm actually going for as well as moisture um for my hair so yeah you guys I really did enjoy this I again I did receive this in a giveaway from ORS curls unleashed so thank you guys so much for selecting me to be a giveaway winner so I can actually try this product out um yeah you guys so I really did like that product so if you guys like these one product tutorials please let me know because I will definitely keep making them for you guys again it's a way for me to actually use products that I have not used yet that are here in my natural hair care collection that I need because if it doesn't work, I need to pass it along to another natural who could actually use it for themselves. So, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this look because this was actually what I was going for. I wanted the fro today because again, we're going to the beach as you guys can see probably. And I didn't want to have to worry about all that extra get up and definition because again, I'm washing my hair tomorrow. So this was perfect for a refresher, I feel. Again, I love the way that my hair turned out. It's soft, it's hydrated, and I do have some definition, which is a biggie so yeah you guys thank you so much for watching my king and queens if you haven't done so already please don't forget to actually subscribe to my channel so that way you guys can be notified when i upload new content here as well as on my other social media platforms i do have links to those sites listed down below in the description bar so that way you can get your daily dosage of me when i'm not here present on youtube okay so Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you'll enjoy the rest of your beautiful day. And I will see you guys in my next upload. I love you guys so much. Mwah! Be blessed, you guys.